Hello, this video is going to show how easy it is to access performance metrics for any of the visualizations in Oracle Analytics simply by activating a menu. This feature is available since Oracle Analytics October 2021 release. So performance metrics are available under developer options. And that's a feature that needs to be activated by each user in their own profile. So let me visit my profile, select the advanced tab and enable developer options. I just have to do this once and for all, save it and close. And now I can see the developer entry on the top right canvas menu. So selecting this choice now opens a nice tab at the bottom of the browser page with a various uh, sub tabs. I can see JSON and XML representation of the workbook. I can see shortcuts to URLs for embedding. I can see information about the data set and the UI options, but I can also see performance tools tab. So here, clicking refresh, reruns all the visas on the canvas and collects performance metrics for each of them. So in this case, we're looking at a viz with an overall execution time of 2.1 second, broken down into server time, streaming time, tile processing time, and so on. So in this case, streaming time here is the one that has the highest cost on my site, which is a network time in this case. If I click on a different viz, numbers are quite different. And the bar chart on the right gives a visual indication of how these numbers break down and compare to each other. As I click on different visas on the canvas, I can see performance number for each of the visas, understanding exactly which of the visas I may have to tune or improve. Looking further in the sub-tabs of performance tools, I can see logical SQL, which is exactly the syntax of the logical SQL that was generated by this viz, the one that I'm sitting on. I can see the query generation log as well as the execution log. The execution log is the entire document that you may have been familiar with under the sessions tab in the console. So lots of information here. You have a, at the very bottom a summary of the entire execution itself, along with a ton of information such as the physical query when we're hitting a physical source. So let me toggle to a different project. And this one is sourced from an analytical view in a database. So that's a database based source. Let me activate developer, look at the performance tool and hit refresh. And here I can see some time spent in their query time. So fetching the information from the database, running it in the database. And if I go to the execution log, I will see here the physical SQL that was sent to the database. In this case, it's an analytical view, physical SQL, as well as the summary information telling me how much time it's spent in the database. So obviously all of this is consistent with the information and the stats. So this is how you use performance tool in Oracle Analytics. Thanks for watching this video.